Hello, hello everyone and welcome to my kitchen. It's Alexis, your Pampered Chef consultant here in Southeast Coastal Georgia where I teach you how to use your Pampered Chef tools along with the recipe so you can make what I'm making at your house. And today we're gonna to be doing caramel latte bread. It's really simple and easy. This is like, man, you should have made this yesterday, right? So I don't know why my screen looks so dark. Well, hopefully some people come in and let me know that they're here. Hello, Sarita uh, Pace, how are you doing? Thank you for joining you, the first one that I see here. Uh, you can do a couple different things. Even on the replay, you can put in hashtag replay because this is being uploaded to YouTube. Uh, you can tap hearts. Definitely give it a like on YouTube and um, follow me over to my new platform, which is on a website called Table, T-A-B-L-E. The link is in my profile. And you'll see pictures over there and the link to um, uh, the replays are over on Table also. I posted yesterday's, uh, what did we make yesterday? Whatever we made yesterday, I posted it there today. Oh, we made the we made the eggplant Napoleon. Guess what? My mom didn't want to have that, that Napoleon I made her. So I ate both of them. Oh. Hey, good afternoon there, Karen30. How are you doing? Hello, Corey. How are you doing? Uh, let's see. Good afternoon, Sarita. Hello, Monica. How are you doing, girl? All right. So, Monica, are you a... Monica, I need to make you a moderator because you are here. Let me see. Manage and and add moderate. There we go. Monica, you can moderate there. All right. Uh, invite... Oh, also, make sure you tap those hearts, like tap the screen, tap, 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 like we used to do on uh, Periscope when you're on TikTok. You can do tap, tap, tap. Reminds me just so much of Periscope, right? Hello, Johanna Macho. Hello, Cat's Cup Coffee. <laughs> Cat's Cup Coffee. Talk about coffee. I'm going to be using uh, some leftover coffee that I had in my recipe. So instead of adding water, I'm going to add a cup, uh, uh, half a cup of coffee in there. All right. Uh, hello, Jan. Hello, Pat's. Pat's away, oh, I don't know, 95 came in. Candy Stewart, 19, how are you doing? Shannon came in. What are you doing today? I have to go to work for four o'clock today. So that means I have to leave the house at 3.30. So I wanna get this cake done so I can leave some for my mom and take it to work and see if they like it, all right? What are we baking today? We are making some caramel latte bread. It's a Pampered Chef mix. How simple can we get? Who has time to be making all this stuff by scratch? No. So this, um, we just need this package of mix here and it's a bread. However, you can, I've made this in the, the stoneware loaf pan. It comes out fabulous, but it does take a little bit longer because it's a little more denser. Today, I'm gonna be making it in the fluted cake pan. Yeah, the fluted cake pan by Pampered Chef. And I forgot to, to grease and flour this baby here. So we're gonna get some butter out and grease that pan and then mix it up and put it all in there. I love to bake too. I like to bake too, but I need somebody to eat it, Corin. I, some Can somebody come to my house and eat this? Otherwise, I gotta send it to work and then those people eat it. <laughs> I could take whatever in there. Yesterday, I, um, I took in the egg bites and I made egg bites. I made sous vide egg bites and I made egg bites using the pressure cooker, the quick cooker, and um, by Pampered Chef. And, uh, hmm. They like the quick cooker one over the sous vide. However, sous vide is the one that uh, Starbucks makes and they're very expensive and it does take a long time to make the sous vide eggs. It took me over two and a half hours to make the sous vide eggs, whereas the quick cooker one, about 20, 25 minutes, it was, it was done. And the new multi cooker that Pampered Chef has, uh, it comes to pressure a lot a lot lot faster than the old one okay so come on in hello drumline mom how are you doing girl hello user 78 what are you doing hello m n noel m noel liz g how are you doing uh hey dior, dior is in the house monica sending some likes and ottomans here we need to get some butter out of the refrigerator okay let's get some butter everything's better with blue bonnet on it no not not really not blue bonnet but real butter we're using the real butter the butter butter deal okay so let's get a little knife. I'm gonna slice a little bit off of here. All right, there we go. Eh, good, good, eh, a little, a good pad of butter. All right, so we got a little pad of butter. Let's put this back in the refrigerator because I don't need it anymore. And I'm gonna get, I'm gonna tear off a little piece of, of, just a little piece, just a little piece of paper towel, okay? So when you get this, yeah, real butter, real butter, butter, butter because, you know, um, what is her name? Uh, Paula Dean, which I have her little sticker up here. Let's see, it's on my refrigerator. Uh, we had to get a new refrigerator last month and um, I took off all the riffraff on there, but I did keep the Paula Dean butter because everything's better with butter on it. Uh, I cook with the real deal. I cook with real sugar. I don't use any substitutes. You can substitute it, but not for me. I'd rather go with the real deal than 
something I have no idea what it's made out of. All right, so let's put that back up there and get our nice little pad of butter. And we're going to butter our little thing right here. All right. Yes, you do. Hey, Sassy Sine, you are now a moderator. You see that? You're a moderator, Sine. Uh, so anyway, this is a pan by Pamper Chef. It's like a small pan. It can make a half a box of cake. All right. And it comes out great. Don't put a whole cake box in here because otherwise it'll be all over the place. But we're going to be making the caramel latte bread, which is available right now. However, this pan is available come Tuesday, March March 1st. It was in the Pamper Chef inventory, but they took it off and now they brought it back because the multi-cooker's here. And we can use this in the multi-cooker, which is the pressure cooker, okay? You can make you can make cake in there too. Uh, yes, you have a moderator too, hoo hoo, yeah. Hey Kathy, how are you doing? Thanks for coming in. Uh, Baby Blue from Heaven, oh, thank you for joining. Hey Dee still, how are you doing? Hey uh, C. Gillen. And we have, I'm like, I can't read all the, all the names coming in and out. So if you could do a couple different things, make sure you comment, all right? I usually say, say hello to you. Uh, tap hearts, because that way um, we get seen in the feed here on TikTok. And I am just, I'm just covering this with all butter. And you know what? I should go get the, the little insert uh, is over in my little uh, repertoire of great Pampered Chef tools for my quick cooker. Uh, man, this is like buttered. This is really, really buttered. Okay, I have some butter left. I'm just going to put this in the refrigerator because I don't want to throw it away. This is still pretty good. It'll, it'll harden up and we can use it again. Let's put that over near the eggs. But now I have to wash my hands because I got, I got butter. But before I do that, let's crack some eggs and put them in the bowl. I'm going to crack the eggs because my hands are already dirty. And then i got to wash my hands because I have eggs in it. Okay, i got to make sure there's no... Um, Shells in there. I, I made uh, the Dulce Leche cake uh, last week. Ooh, that is weird. I've never seen this, but there's an egg with a different color. All right, so I'm going to show you. We're going to flip the camera around in a second. All right. Let me wash our hands. So when you wash your hands, make sure you, you put some plenty of soap on there and sing happy birthday twice. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, everybody born. It's um, February 26th. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, everybody born. It's February 26th. Happy birthday to you. There you go. Hey, Beth. How are you doing, Shannon? All right. So, um... I'm just giving shout outs to people who are like popping in here. Hey, Torchy, Torchy. Oh my God. I've seen you on Periscope. Uh, let's see. Kathy. Hi. <laughs> I don't know what GI means. Uh, follow the host. Thank you, Cindy. Thank you so much. Hey, Betty. How are you doing? So let me go get the little attachment that we could put in there. Hold on a second. All right, so when you cook this with the pressure cooker, it comes with this little stand, all right? And now you can pick it, pick it up in and out of your oven with this rather than putting your fingers on the food. You can pick it up with this. So, and this can go right into your quick cooker mm -hmm, or your multi-cooker now. And we're going to do it that way. So we got that all set up. And I'm going to flip this around. We can put you into the bowl right here and show you what I'm doing. Now, I've never seen... All right, y'all have to see this because I have never, hey, call me Yaz. How are you doing? Thank you for following. All right, let's flip the screen around if I can figure out how to flip it. Share, I can share the screen. Where do, I, where do I flip? Flip the camera. There we go. All right. Yeah, you have my message up there. Do you see my message? All right, so a long time ago, well, it was uh, a year and a half ago, I had a very successful party and my son wrote me this message and it says congratulations on your massive party thank you for everything you do especially helping pay for my furniture hope you have a great day at work love bryce love you bryce all right so that was from my son all right and uh he was moving into an apartment for the first time and we needed to get him a bed and some you know a desk and stuff like that so that's what my message is up there isn't that sweet hey are you using a, a, yes i am using a tripod i'm using a lumi tripod and um, it can go high and it can go low. But look at this. See that? Look how a light yellow that one egg is. The other ones are like orange and the other one's like yellow. Like you see the, see the difference in color? I've never seen that before. All right, so we're going to add in here. Uh, we, I, I'm using three eggs in here because they were medium-sized eggs. And it calls for like 
large eggs, all right? And we're gonna use a half cup of oil. You can use whatever oil you want. If you wanna use coconut oil, vegetable oil, either one works just fine with this recipe, okay? And I always measure it in glass because it's easier to clean oil out of glass than it is plastic. And I'm adding in a, oops, I think I have a little bit too much in here. Um, I need my coffee cup. Nope, I gotta pour some out. I only need a half a cup. All right, so we have a half a cup. This is the um, Measure All by Pampered Chef. Oh, do I have it in the right one? Oops, it's a little less now. Oops, I was looking at the wrong one, y'all. All right, so a half a cup of coffee is going in here. There we go. Make sure there's no eggshells. All right, and that's it. So now we're gonna scramble this baby up. Get those eggs all broken before you add in the dry ingredients and incorporate into your oil and your coffee. The coffee replaces the water because it's a lot more flavorful to have uh, with the uh, caramel latte bread. A latte is coffee, so add a little more coffee in there. Okay, there we go. Look at that, nice and frothy, right? I've, I've always wanted to see how this was made. <laughs> Sassy, that's all you have. I'm using a Pampered Chef batter bowl. I got the um, the uh, mini whisk, which is a free gift when you order uh, Pampered Chef. And my link is in the profile to order any of these any of these products today, okay? Uh, this is a free gift when you spend $80. The, there's a smaller batter bowl that's available when you spend $100. And if you spend $150, you get the, the small batter bowl and this whisk. Uh, at $150 plus you get free shipping. All right, so we got that going. And we're doing the caramel latte bread by Pampered Chef. It's just a mix, just a mix. On the back, the ingredient says, preheat the oven to 350. You never preheat the oven, you always heat an oven, all right? There's no such thing as preheating. That was done by my one of my former chefs that I used to work with. And uh, so we uh, heat the oven to 350 degrees. It's already there. And then we're gonna stir in all these ingredients, one pack, two eggs, a half a cup of water, but we replace the water with coffee, and then a half a cup of vegetable oil, all right? Whew. All right, so I bought oh, both the small bowl and the big batter bowl. Yeah, this is a big batter bowl here. Probably could have used the small one, but I wasn't sure if it all fit, and then I always use small um, bowls, and then I'm like, I should use the bigger one. All right, so the difference, I don't know what the difference is, but this one's really good. And then um, a while back, I did one that's the Dolce Leche. And boy, my coworkers love this one so much, I had to come home and make another uh, batch of it. So this one was excellent. Uh, that one will be available March 1st. This one's available right now. All right, so let's put this right in. There's our package. Ooh, that's, let's smell it. Mmm. Smells good. All right, so we're gonna get uh, our scraper. Now the scrapers by Pampered Chef are the best in the world because they don't turn uh, orange when you put them in tomato sauce. Um, now if you do use, what's that, what's that? Um, turmeric, it might turn yellow. So uh, what you can do is use some Barkeeper's Friend or Bon Ami and get, um, uh, get the orange off. But if you put it in the sun, they come back to white. Yeah, the sun bleaches it back to white. Let me know how I can be a representative for Pampered Chef. Uh, reach out to me. The link is in my profile, and I can get you on board, okay? Uh, there are four uh, different Pampered Chef uh, ki uh, consulting kits available right now. The cheapest one, or the most least expensive one, to start your own business is $25. It's only available in the month of February. It'll be ending uh, the 28th. And then there are three other ones. There's a starter kit, a deluxe kit, kit and the ultimate kit. The ultimate kit is about... Oh my God, I forgot how much it is. Um, it has it has a couple different, and I probably don't have a cal calendar here. Yeah, so the kits are, and there's information on there. Um, here, there it is. Ultimate kit, two seventy nine. But you get all these tools. It's eleven hundred dollars worth of, of Pamper Chef products. So it's a no. It's a win win. Uh, and look, you can even do that little thing right there. And how to be a cons consultant. But you get your choice of either an air fryer the deluxe grill and griddle or the blender you get one of these in that kit there so this is the best value one all right the other ones are just starters if you already have a lot of pamper chef then i suggest these or if you've been a pamper chef consultant you have everything on their son then do the 25 dollar one you get um your your uh website for 90 days and you have a whole lot of opportunities to earn other pampered chef products along the way in your first 90 days all right so we got all that done that's enough of that uh advertising there 
So um, I'm always looking for people to come on my team. I am going off of Facebook and doing all my parties on the new Pampered Chef website called Table. And I have a few parties up now if anybody wants to be invited to one. I also have a VIP group. The link is in my profile to to uh, join the table, my VIP group. And I post what I do here on TikTok or Haps and up over on YouTube. I post it over on table so you can see the replays and get the recipes over there. Okay, here we go. So this is nicely mixed. We don't even need a blender. We just need this to mix it together with our nice little scraper here. And this is a medium sized scraper. There are three different uh, sc scraper sizes. And I'll show you the two other ones. You can see the difference in sizes. So this one I use the most. You can see it's a little off color because I use it all the time. And then this one here is the medium one. Ooh, medium one. There you go. Medium one. Okay. So we got all that. Great scrapers. You all need a scraper in your life. All right. Scrape those bowls and get them all the way off. Oh, that's just beautiful, right? So I did this in the batter bowl because we're going to pour it out using the uh, side right there. Uh, let me know. How, okay, we got that one. What was the name of your tripod again? Uh, it is Lumi. I think it's Lumi. It's either social. Oh, my gosh. Oh, here, social light. It's social light. Look. There we go. Social light. Can I see? Uh, can't take it out. Socialite, S-O-C-I-A-L-L-I-T-E. The Lumi was the was the uh, lighting thing that I um, got that didn't really work very well. So Socialite, socialite.com. All right, there you go. And I got to do my hands free now. Hold on. Sometimes it wants to fall over because I have a very heavy phone, like super heavy. Oh, it reminds me, let's drink some water, Hydration Nation. Whew. I was a little thirsty. All right, let's get our little bowl over here. There we go. And we're gonna pour our batter into our bowl. All right, there we go. I should've got my uh -huh, Lazy Susan and I can just twirl this around. There we go. And one more. There. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh man, this is gonna be so good. I can't wait to share this with everyone. Mm. Look at that. Okay. Now I gotta scrape my bowl just a little bit more. Okay, because I I like everything is good to the last drop, right? <sighs> Maxwell House, good to the last drop. There we go. Yeah, I'm all full, I'm full of like past uh, commercials. I don't watch too many commercials now to to even remember their jingles. Okay, there we go. Yum. Let me pull it. I had some weird dreams last night. Alright, let's put that in the sink. And who wants who wants to lick the um the scraper? Oh yeah, here. Oh my god, this is so good. Mmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Very good. Alright, I gotta put this in water now. Alright. So the next thing you need to do is to get off all these little um, miscellaneous drips that we have. So get yourself another little little um, wipey and wipe that off, all right? Because you don't want them, it'll bake right on there. You don't want to bake it on, like even this one here. Get that off. Oops, let me see if I can use it one more time. Pull that over. Let's get that, that one off there. There we go. It's looking pretty good. I did pretty good getting it inside the bowl. Oh, missed one. So this is going to go in the oven, 350 degrees, and it says for 45 to 55 minutes, but that's in a loaf pan, okay? So I'm going to put this in the oven, but we're going to put it in for, hmm, let's do 35 minutes because this one, since there's a hole right here, it'll cook quicker versus one big long pan that's deep, okay? So let's put it in for 35 minutes. Alexa, set the timer for 35 minutes. 35 minutes. Starting now. All right. Whew. Man, that was good. Good to the last drop. Okay, let's see if we can flip the camera back around and say hello to everybody. Now that I have you on the, on the camera. There we go. Hello, hello. Hey, Ann Rush. How are you doing, girl? How's it over in Denmark? Oh, my God. How are things in Denmark? Y'all, the world's falling apart on it. 
Um, it says 45 to 55 minutes, but I'm going to put in there 35 because I'm using a different vessel and the vessel has a hole in the middle, like a bunch pan. It is a mini bunch pan. And, um, there you go. Uh, what phone do you use? I use, um, a very big phone. <laughs> I use a super big phone, y'all. It's, um, it's the large one. It's an iPhone. I have the, I bought the one with the most storage. It has like over 500 mgs or whatever on it usually it comes in like 64 132 and you're like yeah that's fine no alexis likes to download her videos and i don't want them saying yeah your space is, is all tied up your space is all tied up because all right guess how many pictures now i haven't looked in a while how many pictures do you think i have on my phone how many screenshots selfies pictures videos we can do videos okay too I, think I know the number on the videos. How many pictures do you think I have on my phone? I'll, I'll wait for you. Just put a number in there. Put a number. <laughs> yeah. There you go. How many? How many? 10,000. Higher than 10,000. Keep going. Keep going. Higher than 10,000. How many pictures does Alexis have on her phone? Come on now. How many pictures do I have on the phone? Higher than 10,000. Somewhere in the time, 53, somewhere. We are somewhere in time. <laughs> That's a really good name. Zero, because technically it's a photo, not pictures. Okay, photos, pictures, whatever you call Danny. How many How many do I have? It's called pictures on my phone. How, 20, higher than 25,000. Sine, you're right after yourself. Higher than 50,000. <laughs> Monica says 27. Higher than 27, higher than 50. Higher, 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 higher. Higher than 35, higher than 35,000, higher than 35,000. Keep going. All right, the next number is probably going to be lower than whatever you say. Hello to the sweetest lady on TikTok, says Sally Life in Florida. Hey, you're from Naples. Kathy, right? What's the difference between a picture and a photo? I have no idea. I, I have a screenshot is where I take a, a picture from whatever I'm looking at. Like I could take a screenshot from here versus I can download a picture. I can take a picture. How big is your storage? Uh... 500 and some milligrams or whatever. It's not the 60, 60, it's not the 132, it's not the 200, it's the 500. Yes, Danny, that's the difference between a picture and a photo. Uh, there we go. Uh, a picture, a picture you draw it. Okay, I don't know what that is. Uh, a, oh, a picture, that's a painting. Or a drawing. <laughs> picture is something like you look at. All right, 72,115. Lower than that. Lower than 72,000. Uh, lower than 72. <laughs> Did it make even other? No, a painting you paint. Yeah, painting you paint. A draw you draw. A picture you take. <laughs> Let me see. What anyway, 75,000. Lower than 75,000. Higher than 35,000. <laughs> what number do I have? Shall I write on a piece of paper? Do I have a piece of paper here? Probably not. No, I don't have a piece of paper here, but I do. I think I can write it on here. Do I have a pen? Oh, I have a marker. I think I'll be right on here. All right, I wrote it down. I wrote it down. I wrote it down. I wrote the number down. You see it? It's right here. It's right on here. <laughs> uh, lower than 69,994. Lower than 65,000. Lower than 68. I think Danny needs a dictionary, says Harleen. I think so, too. Do a painting to... A, no, a painting, you paint it. Okay, yeah, we got that one. <laughs> 63,132. Higher, 64. I think Monica has it right on there. Monica's right in there. It is 64,000 um, uh, pictures I have. Uh, it's more than 64,000 pictures I have on, on my phone. Yeah, Alexis is not to delete. So uh, I need to st I need to give myself 15 minutes a day and just delete, 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 delete. Oh, which bring, bring, brings me to something. We're, we're cooking our caramel latte bread. If you missed it, follow me over to YouTube and you can see it. Or drain the table and I'll I'll put this um I'll put this TikTok on both platforms. Okay? Yay! I won. <laughs> Oh, thank you so much. Tap hearts, make a comment, and share. If you see that little share button down there, just touch that share. Oh, only one person shared out. Wait. Yeah, it's only one. So touch that thing that says share and copy it. Just touch the share, copy it. 
It just, it, it gives your algorithms a higher to go up because we only have 15 people in the house here. So take with the hand, taken with the hand. Yeah, with the thumb, <laughs> not with the hand. You have to do it with the thumb. You have to press the button. Uh, a picture is usually made with hands, especially those that are drawn or painted while a photo is taken. I don't have no idea. Danny, do your own broadcast on pictures, drawings, and, and photos. <laughs> That's so funny. No, hey, uh, I wish, oh my God, thank you for sending likes. Hey, Gary's in the house. How are you doing? Hey, Salty Life. Thank you for doing the, doing the thing. So get that share button. I see four people, three other people share it out. Like here, I'm going to try and do it myself. Copy the link. I shared it myself. See, now it's gone up to five, including myself. <laughs> see, and it even tells me I shared it. <laughs> and Russ shared it. Hey, Anne, can you put this over in uh, the Discord? Go over to Discord and, and put the link over in Discord. Oh my gosh, I got a zit on my chin, y'all. I don't, I rarely ever have zits, but this one, it keeps on building up. I keep on scratching it off. Google definition, there you go. Uh, okay, Sassy Sinead shared it, I shared it. I want to color, oh, I want to, okay, Sassy, I want to color on TikTok, but I don't know what tripod to, to get. You can use this one because it goes down over it. Um, I don't know where all those people on Periscope. I know uh, Jeff no longer does his, his, I loved his tripod. His tripod lasted me forever. Uh, Jeff with scoping products. Uh, I share it. Thank you, Sassy. Are you on Facebook? Yeah, I'm on Facebook. Uh, but I'm trying to get off of Facebook. I'm really trying to get off of Facebook. Thank you for Discord there. Man, coffee machines warming up over there. Aaron, but I don't want to support them. I know, I know what you mean. They had one that you can go over and go down into it, but this one works just as fine. I think it was maybe $30 or so. I can't remember. It's been a while since I had I had a breakdown because my other one was dying on me. I'll show you how I have it rigged up. Hold on. So this is the one that I got from Scoping Products, and it, this this other one is a lot bigger. I'll I'll switch this around in a second. I'll take you off, but it was dying. The bottom was breaking down on me, so I I got a lot of this black tape, and then I had to do this because it was like falling over. But this supports it. So this was one that I had that was very very good. But I'm gonna take you off this this tripod, and I'll flip you back, and I'll show you what it looks like. Okay. So let me see, without ending the broadcast, flip the camera, and there we go. So this tripod, I sit on my, yeah, my beautiful uh, acacia wood cutting board, and it does have the legs, and I do, uh, this is just a handle, I just didn't want that thing going all over the place, because it, it sort of twirls. Um, at the bottom of it here, the only thing I found, that you need an Allen wrench, um, because sometimes this part gets loose and you, if you have an Allen wrench, you can tighten it back up and have the legs. Um, cause otherwise, sometimes they go flat if you unscrew it. So that's that. Um, it does have a clip. I don't know where the, I don't use that Bluetooth stuff. And so this one here, um, it has a lot of attachments. Like you can put this one, this thing can go straight up. It can, this one angles it over here. This one has more, um, more Oh, you tighten it right there, okay? And then it has enough, like, this one screws in, all right? Versus this one here. This one was a spring form one, okay? And my phone has a really, really big case on it. Um, but this one just screws into it, and then it holds it there. And you can go up and down, okay, like that on it, all right? Does that make sense? Does it go downwards? Yeah, like this way. Yeah, and then you have it going down on it so that you can see. The only thing is, um, it only it stands this high. So if you are um, broadcasting, you probably can't see it because when this is on my countertop over here and I have you facing my down into the bowl like this, you are pretty high up. Like I am only 5'4", and so when this is up here, um, I sort of, like this one I can see. I can see the words and all like that, but off center, I have to like look over on it. Okay. Uh, this one, this one here was a lot higher. You can see the difference in the, the height of each one. 
this is like a, a seminar on on you can see the difference in the height on them this one i always had a tippy toe on it this one's a little bit more easier to read to go down on it and yeah you can turn it down on that see how how the difference is even though it's like maybe four maybe five inches there it does make a difference on it okay so you had one of those <laughs> so anyway that's uh that's that yeah so anyway this is how i stand um i put i put the board right here i really need a little bit it's more of a square board than the rectangle one, but it works for me on this one. I've, I've always done it this way. Um, yeah, I just stand there. My, my kitchen is very, very small. Like, there you go. That's my entire kitchen. So if I can broadcast in a very tiny kitchen, y'all can um, broadcast anywhere <laughs> cooking. I don't have uh, a, the best kitchen for, for broadcasting, so... Uh, let's see. I'm going to flip the camera back. There we go. There we go. Here we am. Nice board. <laughs> Thanks. So anyway, that's, um, that's my kitchen, y'all. All right. So we have, um, did we, did Alexa set the timer? Alexa, how much time we have on the timer? You have 23 minutes. Left oh, on we the did. We did. Timer. All right. Put this over the, off the way. Whew. All right, I think I can make a cup of coffee. What do you think? We only have nine people in the room right now, so I had one of those. Does it go downward? Yeah, it does. And I miss anything? All right, so encourage your viewers to share your live and invite more friends. There you go. Gary shared the... Thank you, Gary, for sharing out. Um, and shared. I think we've got everybody on there. That, that's coming aboard. Uh, nice board says Sarita o o Pace. Uh, do you know when Christmas... Christine Brown will do her cooking show. No, I don't know. I posted that um, on table and I got it from somebody else. Somebody sent me that. And I was like, oh, I have no idea. And I'm like, no, I don't even know what, what platform it was on. Food Network? No, it's probably on the other one that they were on, TLC. She isn't using, She isn't she using, P yeah, she is. She had all PC tools right there. Yeah, Christine Brown with um, uh, what uh, Sister Wives is um, separated from the guy, and she's doing her own thing, and it looks like she might be getting a cooking show where she was cooking, and she had Pampers Chef tools there. So that was pretty good. Hey, it's Weirdo. Sent you likes. Thank you. Um, that's Weirdo. Uh, so we are doing caramel latte bread. It's in the oven. We have about 23 minutes or so. I'm not sure if I want to stay on that long or come back and then show you what it looks like when we're we're cutting it. Or I can cut it. I can do it on, on a little clip like I did with the chocolate cake, with the Boston cream cake that I did. That was so good. I didn't even eat any of it. I did have the... Have the um, a little piece of cake and the, I ate the icing. You know, I love icing. I just eat the icing. Uh, so, hey, thank, thank you, Gary, for sending the likes there. So, Hydration Nation, make sure you drink a lot. I already had an apple today. I should, I should eat a banana and make a cup of coffee. Let's do that. And then um, I talked talk, talk to you about tripods per sassy. Hopefully, you can find a good um, uh, tripod. Now, this tripod can go on the floor and then come up and then you can go over your over your um art so if you're sitting down because you're gonna be sitting on the table and you really don't want it too high up because you want to see what the what the comments are on there uh on it uh there are smaller ones that you can put like right next to you but i stand when i cook and so i need to be face level to 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 you all to I, it's just more comfortable comfortable for me to do it this way all right uh, any other questions you have here uh, on on uh, going live or cooking or Pampered Chef? Hey, Jess Meg, thank you for coming in. We have a caramel latte bread. It's in the oven cooking right now. It's a Pampered Chef uh, mix, and it smells delicious in my house right now. How is Weight Watcher going? Weight Watchers is going good. I'm not tracking, but I am maintaining at like 142 to 144. So I really need I really need to get down to that 142. That's my that's my uh, perfect range and then when I get down to 142 I really want to go down to 138 138 I was I was fit as a fiddle on that one right um, and uh, yeah so just eat a lot more veggies I haven't been eating as many veggies and I'll show you what, what I look like without the apron on because sometimes the apron I think oh let's see if we can no oh, it's gonna fall you're falling I got it. 
it don't want to stay. It doesn't want to stay right here. See, it's falling over on me. Let me see if I can get you there. All right, angle it down so you don't have that light right there. So, hands free. So anyway, yeah, I have my apron on, which is pampered shop. And I have my uh, outfit that I go to work in. We have to wear a red shirt, black shirt, or some kind of forest green shirt. And I don't have no forest green shirt. So, and I have my little skirt with the um, leggings on it. So this is my uniform to go to work. But you can see, hmm, yeah, before I used to be as wide as a house, like, this way. Um, now I, I still have a, at 144, I have a gut. So we got to get rid of this, even though you can't really see it very well. I feel, I feel it there. All right. Um, other than that, yeah. And I forget what size this shirt is. Can you see what size it is? I'm not sure if it's a, a large, it, it's, this was a Walmart shirt. Yeah, uh, and, and what I want to focus on uh, the next couple months, because <sighs> bathing suit weather is here. All right, yeah, bathing suit weather is here. It is, let's ask Alexa what the temperature is outside. Alexa, what's the temperature outside? Right now, it's 76 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh, it's only 76 today. Tonight, expect a low of 56 degrees. Alexa, what's the weather like for tomorrow? Here's the forecast for tomorrow. Look for lots of clouds with a high of 75 degrees 75. Fahrenheit and a low of 55 degrees. Okay, so not good. Yesterday was a really good day. It was so sunny and we have a lot of pollen popping out there. But I really want to focus on this part here. This is old age coming in, but everybody gets this. It's the, the bat wings right here. So I really want to focus on, on the bat wings area um, so that when you're out, you don't have that this part here going on. So that's my focus. I am 59 years young and um, looking forward to 60. All right. Yeah. The big 6-0 this year. Uh, hey, Zendia B. I don't know how you say that. Stan. <laughs> Hi, read me. I Read your what? I can't say your name. Zai B. Zai B. Zai B. How are you doing? Zoe, Zoe. Well, you should put Zoe in there, girl. <laughs> Does, if anybody is here, we have six people here. Uh, if you broadcast, please put in that you broadcast, and then I follow you. you you're a newbie on here there, Zoe. Uh, Zoe. Newbie, newbie. Uh, it took me probably a few months to get to a 1,000 people before I was able to go live. However, I did um, start mid-January to go live, and it took me about a month to get to a 1,000 uh, actively posting on TikTok and um, just getting it up because Facebook banned me from going live. At least, or I, at least I haven't seen the oh you can't go live, but let me try it again and see what happens. Whoop, you'd be banned. Hey Monica, thanks for sending the likes. <laughs> so tap hearts, share out, and follow. My name is Alexis. I live here in Southeast Coast of Georgia, and I teach you how to use your Pamper Chef tools. Uh, let's see, and if you're interested host a party. It's really easy. It doesn't cost you a dime except for a little bit of time to, to, um, still, still what? Yeah, I know. Still banned. Still banned. I'm going to go, after I get down here, I'll try to do it again and I'll send you a message saying, yep, still banned on FB. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Uh, and it's all because, you know what? I have my apron on inside out and you didn't even tell me, but my, my thing, this, Hey, Monica, does this read right? Because my, my apron's on inside out now. <laughs> I have it backwards. I was like, where's my where's my where's my little dots? Where's my dots? Reads right. <laughs> that read see to me that reads uh, wrong backwards. This reads right to me. But now does okay. So Monica, does my put it on backwards? <laughs> Keep it backwards. There we go. <laughs> I have no pockets, but there you go. Alexis, pampered chef. Look at that. <laughs> so funny. Well, I definitely have to watch the replay now. <laughs> there we go. That's backwards. This is right. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Wear the name from backwards. There we go. All right. Uh, Alexis, how much time do I have on the timer? I'm going to show you what it looks like in a second. Put the oven light in. Alexa, how much time do we have on the timer? You have 14 minutes. Oh, we have 14 minutes. Minute 
Oh, it's looking beautiful down there too. It's looking really, really good. I may have to test it because it's looking brown. Oh, I got. Mm. I dripped some. Everybody want, needs one of these, and it's normally not crooked, but this is a cake tester, and I put a um, uh, a straw over the protector here, okay? Because I can see it in the drawer. This gets lost, but with the color uh, straw over it, I can see it in my drawer. How how is work? Work is great. Work is great. I work tonight, so hopefully it's a hundred dollar night. $125 night. Um, that's what I'm going for tonight. $125. Even $150. I could use $150. So say, say some prayers um, that everybody wants to come out and eat eat food tonight. Okay. So let me let me take a look on down here. Because it's no, it's it's not done yet. No, not done yet. Ugh, not done yet. Oh, it's oh it's it's not done yet. I just wanted to eat this. Yeah, $150. It's dinner night. I did $108 yesterday on um on Friday for lunch for lunch yeah it's not that much most most wait waiters waitresses make a whole lot more than that where did my thing go okay I lost I lost a little thingy oh here it is stop looking I did write this down okay we'll put it underwater um, yeah so that's life is tough financially challenged but I love what I do. I love what I do. So I'm going to turn this off and I will do a short video afterwards of slicing it. We'll let it cool down and then bring it, bring it back in. But I'll flip you over and we'll do a live view of what it looks like um, in the, in the thing. And then I'll end from here because I need to still go walk yet. Flip the camera. Here we go. We're going down into the oven itself. Ah. Can you see it in there? All right, I'm gonna open it up really quick and then we're gonna end the broadcast. Let me figure out where I end it. All right, yeah. Wow, really, yeah, 150, yeah. There we go. So there it is, it's in the oven cooking really well. And I'll see you all next time. All right, talk to y'all later, bye. Now I can't figure out how to stop this. Okay, here we go, end now.